This is brand new at 10. A Denver 7 viewer reached out to us believing her gas range killed her beloved pets. Denver 7's Jason Grenauer explains what happened and how to prevent it from happening to you. Welcome to Under Your Gas Range, home of a valve you've probably never seen before. It controls the mixture of air and gas, but if that valve is a little bit off, that mixture could be unsafe and you could have a problem. Here we go. How about if I screw Jared? Yeah, it's better. This bird happy home isn't as happy as it used to be. When they lose a friend, they get they get depressed. Micah Medway's longtime parakeet and Conyer both died the same night. Birds are so susceptible to toxins and gases. Yeah, it was carbon monoxide poisoning. Excel confirmed that her oven was the source of the gas leak. I was livid. So we went low to investigate. This one was almost completely closed, so the fuel mixture was off. Uh, it was putting off excessive CO. This is a picture of what that valve looked like the night the birds died. That valve window is just about closed. Once a GE technician paid a visit, this is what it looks like now. Well, that tells me that uh, the mi the mixture was wrong and the, the uh, stove wasn't adjusted properly. And since the simple fix, she hasn't had any issues. Now, I spoke to several appliance experts today. They tell me they've never heard of this kind of problem, that most gas ranges come right from the factory and are installed without any modification. But they tell me under the right set of circumstances, this could happen. Get your stove checked, see that it's adjusted properly, and just to be on the safe side, better CO detectors, definitely. In Centennial, I'm Jason Grenauer, Denver 7. And Micah did have a CO detector, but the levels of gas were just low enough that they went unnoticed, so she has since gotten a more sensitive one.